Hi guys, so today we're gonna be painting on jeans. So, first of all, I'm gonna use this acrylic marker from Miniso. It's a white acrylic marker. And it will, you know, it will work on jeans because I tried pencil and like color pencils and pen and it wasn't visible on the jeans. So I'm gonna be using this. Yeah, so here it is. So I'm going to be making some cute butterflies and like little tiny moon and stars. And I think it looks pretty cool. And I'm thinking uh, maybe the butterflies could be like pink or orange or yellow or something like that. So let's see how it goes. So here are some of my acrylic paints. Most of them are from CraftSmart. And I got this separately, but this whole uh, box, I got it for like only a dollar, so it was pretty cheap. But I don't really like the quality of them. Like, they're a bit, I don't know, they don't have a very glossy finish. So maybe after finishing it, I could cover it with some Mod Podge. So it would give it a shiny finish, and it won't scratch off. Ooh, what's this? I also got these pastels. From Craftsmart. It's like light pink, light blue, lemon yellow, and light purple. And I also have these uh, metallic ones. They're not from Craftsmart. They're from Folk Fold. I don't know, I can't focus. And it's golden. Oh, this one's from Craft Smart. This is silver. I also have these acrylic paints from Mary's. They're not in America. They're I got them from Pakistan. They're not available here. I think they're mostly available in Asian countries. And I also have these Winsor Newton acrylic paints, but I'm not going to use these to color to, you know, paint on my jeans. I think I'm going to use Craft Smart and some of these Mary's paints. Okay, so I think I've decided what the color color scheme would be. So this big one, I'm going to paint it pink and white. I'm going to try to add in a little bit of orange so it's like shaded. And then this uh, little one, I'm going to paint uh, yellow and orange. Yeah, and I'm going to be using some of this peach with the pink. And I don't know, I'm not decided which pink I'm going to use. Either this Oprah Rose from Winsor Newton or this Rose. I think it's going to be, I think I'll just use this, not this. I'm going to save that for my canvases. And yeah, and I, I, I don't know, maybe I'll make these uh, little moons uh, golden and the stars a uh, little silver. And... Yeah, and I'll also have to add black paint. So I'm going to use Mary's for that one too because that has a bit of a glossy finish. So yeah, I'll do that. And let's see how it goes. Okay, so I think I'm going to paint this one. Okay, I keep being like, I should paint this like this. And then I change my decision. I'm like painting that other thing. So yeah, this is final now. Pink. This will be pink. And then from here, it will be like purple. It will be blended in the middle. And there will be like black pattern here that you see in monarch butterflies. And then I'll give it some of these, um, what do you call it? Antennas? Yeah, some of those. And this one, here it will be orange. And here it will be yellow. It will blend. And then same with this, a little bit of black pattern and antennas. So let's see how it goes. Okay guys, so when I paint directly on this, it's it's not covering the jeans properly. So I think I need to put some white paint first and then I'll uh when it's dry, I'll I'll put another coat of pink paint and then, you know, the whole thing. Okay, so I have painted all of them with white paint, like a really rough one coating of white paint. And now I'm going to paint on top of it. And let's see how it goes. So I think it's going well because now it's much more visible, right? And it's blending with the white too because the white is still wet. So it's, I think it's going to be a good, like a blending 
will be a good way to blend yeah I'm going to do that and when I'm when I'm done I'll resume the video okay so I think it's looking pretty great I'm just going to put in uh, some black paint or I could also use a black sharpie that will be much easier in making patterns so I'll try either one of them and then I'll show you guys the results okay as you can see I've painted all of them and now I'll paint it with black paint or I'll see if I can use a black sharpie all right so I have painted all of these with black paint on the borders so this and this and now I like I'm confused should I use a white acrylic marker or should I use a uh, white paint oh it's the black paint okay, let me get a white paint it's the white paint hmm maybe I can try the acrylic marker if it's not strong enough I'll use the paint yeah I'm gonna do that okay so this is the final result and you can see I use the white acrylic marker and I think I need to brighten up the stars a little bit but overall it's fine and this little butterfly is hidden so you can't really see it like immediately and this leg I think I did these ones much better than this one because this is really big so you can you can see its flaws these are tiny so you can't like see its flaws immediately but yeah this is the final result and I'm quite happy with it as this is my first attempt